Tonight, a show of support for a three-year-old boy who is battling cancer. Dozens of people showed up to shave their heads for Quinn. Just a day after his third birthday, Quinn Waters was diagnosed with brain cancer. Quinn's mother, who is a Quincy police officer, says the outpouring of support has been incredible. Young and old. How's it feel, buddy? Kind of cold, like just tingly. <laughs> Men and women. So chilly already. Thanks to the corner barber shop, the Quincy police family has one more thing in common. They all shave their heads to show three-year-old Quinn Waters that he's not fighting alone. He's going through chemotherapy. Uh, he's obviously losing his hair. He's, he's in his third round right now. On February 11th, just a day after his third birthday, Quinn was rushed to Children's Hospital. He had some minor medical stuff going on. They did an MRI, and that's where they discovered the uh, mass on his brainstem. Quinn's mother, Tara Waters, is a patrol officer on the Quincy Police Force. And when word got out about her little boy's fight against cancer, the community rallied around the boy, who they have dubbed the Mighty Quinn. Yeah, my son is, is the same age. So with smiles on their faces and hope in their hearts. Um, I don't know. It doesn't look too bad. It'll grow back. It's only hair, right? They came by the dozens to shave it all off. For the mighty Quinn. Quinn has no choice about having no hair, so them volunteering to shave their heads means a lot. I'm going to go buy some sunscreen. My head. More than $20,000 was raised today to support the mighty Quinn. The money's going to St. Baldrick's Foundation to support childhood cancer and research.